Hello everyone and welcome to the next series on car stations from Innovation Industries YouTube channel. I'm Jake Tyler. This video is over swing return car stations which is the second most common type of operating panel. The most common types of swing returns are the full swing like the one pictured and the mini swing which we'll take a look at in a moment. The full swing incorporates the car operating panel into the return itself and allows the entire return wall to swing open via piano hinges located on the opposite side of the jam post towards the sidewall. The side view to the right shows us the return looking towards the inside of the jam. You can see the devices behind the faceplate of the panel which are secured via studs to an 18 gauge cold roll steel subplate which is laminated to the back of the 16 gauge stainless steel faceplate allowing the devices to protrude through the front of the return. Let's take a look at this swing return from AutoCAD perspective for a moment. Here you can see several critical points of measurement consisting of panel width, post depth, return flange, return height, and pivot point. For more information on what these measurements mean and how to get them, you can check out our video on surveying a swing return. Now let's move on to the next type of swing return, the mini swing. The mini swing is often referred to in the industry as a Dover mini swing due to the Dover Elevator Division being a very popular manufacturer of this style of swing from the early 80s on through the late 90s. You can see that the mini swing is not designed to integrate the whole return into a control panel but only a portion of it. In a 2D environment you can see more detail on how it differs from its counterpart the full swing. Like the full swing it requires some measuring to ensure proper fit. If you would like to go into more detail on how to get the measurements you need and what they mean to you, please see our video for surveying swing returns. This style of swing was more standardized than the full swing, so the measuring is not quite as intensive to ensure proper fit. This is an actual picture of a Dover mini swing that gives you a clear view on how the mini swing is mounted. You can see that it is mounted between a column of fixed return on the right and a column on the left. Thanks for watching Swing Returns. Check out our YouTube channel for more videos.